health matters this morning. Carbs can be a problem for some people when it comes to eating it every single day. But Susie from Whole Health Nutrition is here to give us a few tricks to switch that up. This all looks amazing, by it, the way. And it smells yeah, amazing. Too. Shall we begin yeah. here? Yes. Well, I think it's safe to say yeah. that we all love carbs. But I all day, every day. I think it's also safe to say <laughs> that eating too many can be not so kind to our waistlines, yes. right? Mm -hmm. uh, so coming from an Italian family, but also being a nutritionist, Ooh, I set tough. off on a lifelong crusade <laughs> to try and find healthy alternatives, but that tastes just as great. Awesome. And I think I've done it. Okay, nailed it. <laughs> so first off is my absolute favorite pasta alternative, which is this edamame pasta. That's really cool. All now, right. they've somehow oh. managed to turn edamame beans into something that looks, feels, and tastes yeah. like actual pasta. Look at this. So as you can see here, Ooh, it's warm. very similar <laughs> texture. Yeah, I made it this morning. Very similar mm. texture. Yeah, very. Also has a really neutral taste, so will go great with any sauce. Now, one serving of this okay. contains only six net carbs compared to over 40 in regular pasta. Wow. That's now, insane. Is this, is this going to fill you up and keep oh, you full? Yeah. That was my next talking uh, point. So go. it's really I like I it's be full. packed with fiber and protein, which will make you feel full longer and prevent overeating later on. This would actually make you feel more full than regular pasta itself. I'm down. I'm, right? I'm switching over I'm there. I'm so excited. Love yeah. Uh, so next up is Ezekiel products. Now this comes in a bunch of different brands, so mm -hmm. you can have different flavor breads, even burger buns. They have English muffins and tortillas. These are uh, awesome. And these are great because they're made from sprouted grains, and Those. the sprouting process partially breaks down the starch, mm -hmm. which in turn makes the carb count lower, and also makes nutrients more readily available and easier to digest. Yeah. Who knew? Who That's knew? Amazing. They're also made from a variety of whole grains and legumes as opposed to just wheat alone. Okay. So a lot more nutrition than a regular slice of bread. That's awesome. Love these. Yes. Yeah. So next up is my favorite rice alternative, which I know you love as well, quinoa. So much quinoa. Yeah, so <laughs> much. It's gotten very popular and there is a reason. Yeah. Much lower in carbs, much higher in fiber and protein. Protein, right? Yeah. Yes. Six it's, grams. It's actually considered a perfect protein because wow. it contains all nine essential amino acids. I guess I'm healthy then. Fun fact, yes. <laughs> <Slightly. laughs> so I like to use this in place of rice in any recipe, mm -hmm. but I also love quinoa bowls, which are great for batch cooking and keeping in the fridge for quick meals. And yes. I'll put recipes for that up on our site. That's awesome. If you guys okay. are interested. Yes, please. Yes. So next up is cauliflower crust pizza. Mm, now I like this. to make, I know, have you ever had it? Oh my God. It's actually oh, very so good. It tastes much. similar. It's it tastes like, like eating pizza. I really yeah, can't taste the really, difference. Yeah. So yeah, I like to make my own cauliflower crust and I'll put the recipe on our site as well. Oh, but if you're in a pinch and don't really have a lot of time, there are a lot of good brands that don't have a lot of questionable ingredients, yep. like ingredients you can't pronounce, right? Oh, yeah, I hate that. But this mm -hmm. one is good. It's from Trader Joe's. Mm -hmm. um, now, this pizza usually has about half the amount of carbs as regular pizza, in addition, addition to some key nutrients like vitamin K and vitamin C. That's awesome. And like I said, it has a pretty neutral taste. So once you add the sauce and toppings, you really can't taste the difference between this and you regular really, pizza. For you sure. really can't. Like, I'm yeah. It's, it's and it's really healthy. Good. Right? Yeah. I think it's less greasy too, or at least oh, the yeah. times that I've made yeah. it. Yeah, right? and like when it's it just sits in your hand better. Yeah. I, yeah, I just like it. Better. Yeah. Love it. Definitely. Okay. okay, and last but certainly not oh, least is for smell. all of you with a sweet tooth. It smells so good. I, yes. <laughs> I actually had these for breakfast. Yeah. Because they're so nutritious that they're <laughs> really? considered more of a breakfast so than what a are dessert. They made with? So I so commercial baked goods are usually used with uh, white flour, mm -hmm. which is super high in carbohydrates and doesn't really have that much nutrition as it is. Mm -hmm. So I like to cook using almond flour. Yeah. Now almond flour is simply made from ground almonds. That's the only That's ingredient. Yeah. yeah, perfect. Uh, it's packed with protein, fiber, and healthy fats, and can be used to substitute white flour in recipes at a one-to-one -one ratio. Okay. So that's what, just what I do. Yeah. Yeah. I perfect. just take regular awesome. recipes and I use almond flour instead. That's how I made these muffins and these cookies. And they are delicious. I had them for breakfast. You can have there are dark chocolate chips, 60% oh. cacao, so it's a little bit healthier. Well, this is fantastic. Yes. So yeah. where can people find all the information? So all the information will be posted on our site. I'm going to do a blog post with all the recipes. Okay. But regarding these products, you can really find any type of these products at any store, Hannaford mm -hmm. or like Shaw's. Changes. It would probably be yeah. in like the designated healthier mm -hmm. food section. Okay. Um, but if you're at City Market or Healthy Living, they'll be awesome. very much in plain sight. This is fantastic. Thank yeah. You again, yeah, thank you. Thank you, you guys. All yeah, this will this be on fun. our website too, myshamplainvalley.com. We'll be back.